boy, would I like to say a few words. <laughs> <laughs> what an honor to be here amongst so many women, so talented and so accomplished in their fields. And to see these young people today who are here with us tonight, I am so encouraged at the talent that exists. And I invite you to continue on your journey and do the very best that you can. We need your talent. For me, it is community involvement that is a part of my heart and a part of my family. For we work with the homeless individuals in around the Hartford area. We are the ones that are there at the river's edge to speak with those individuals who sleep there at night. And we invite them into shelters and we work with them very closely. And when I see somebody who is homeless and feeling invisible, and we take them by the hand and we take them into the shelter and we continue to work with that individual, one in particular who went on to college and who became a member of an honor society and invited us there as his parents because he didn't have any. My husband and I were there. We were as proud parents. And we watched this young gentleman who thought he was invisible to the world come into the room and he was as a child looking for us. Where are they? Oh, there you are. Okay, now I can proceed and off he went to join those who were honorable people and members of the Honor Society. What an achievement that is. And Dr. Bell, I am a first generation. My father was a coal miner in Pennsylvania and my mother, God bless her, was with me and experienced my graduation from UConn. Go Huskies. <laughs> Another part of my heart. <laughs> And I can remember graduation day where she had to step aside and go into a ladies room to take nitroglycerin tablets. She had a heart condition, but she was so excited. And she was a strong woman who supported me in my efforts and said, you can do anything you wanna do. And boy, that encouragement just stayed with me the rest of my life. And I give that encouragement to you, you that are young and with us tonight, and those who are professional women in your fields, I encourage you and I invite you to take another step forward, for we're here to support you, and we say, go girl. <laughs> Thank you.